what's really going on you guys if you guys are new to my channel my name is really kobe so make sure you guys go ahead subscribe comment like all of that right now okay make sure you go ahead and watch all of my previous videos so you can catch up so but if you're not new here welcome back y'all already know what's going on it's sunday the start of like christmas week and <clears throat> I'm just like preparing about to like clean up, like do some laundry, fold some clothes type stuff, like clean up because, um, you know, that's basically what we do on Sundays. Uh, what else? That's about it. I really just been up for like a minute, just sitting around, just being lazy, doing a little bit of nothing. And I'm, I've been in a frenzy like since the beginning of last week like this whole weekend because i don't have a haircut y'all like let me tell y'all let me tell y'all the story time so okay when i was in baton rouge for thanksgiving i ended up getting i ended up staying like thanksgiving weekend all the way to like the next week or whatever and i got a haircut on a tuesday okay so usually i get my haircut on a friday but i got my haircut on a tuesday this time and you know it just kind of messed up my routine of getting my hair cut. So by by the next Tuesday, after I got my hair cut that Tuesday, my hair didn't already go back. So I got another one because I just can't not, not have a haircut. So it just kind of threw me off. So I'm trying to get back on the schedule of getting my hair cut on Fridays. However, whenever I booked my last haircut on a Tuesday, I tried to book one for Friday and I booked it for it. The Friday, last Friday instead of this Friday. So, I missed my haircut appointment because basically I never had one on this Friday. And I just been in a frenzy. Now I got a connecting beard coming in. And I don't know. That's just not me. I wonder how I would look with this though. If I just let that grow out. But like I said, I'm about to do some laundry. And... Yes, let me show y'all my cute pajamas that I got. Because I got some really, really cute pajamas from, uh, some really cute pajamas from, uh, what's that place called? What's that place called? Target. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all fix my camera. Because y'all know I be recording off my phone. Like I said, ain't nothing wrong with recording off y'all phone. As long as you get the video done. As long as you get the video done. You make sure the quality is good. It's good. So... I got these cute like pajama pants from <clears throat> Target. It's actually a set. But you know, this like the traditional like uh Christmas pajama like uh pattern, like the red and the black pad. Now see, I'm probably gonna wear it like y'all know the Christmas parties is coming up, and you know everybody always do like the Christmas onesie, Christmas party, ugly Christmas sweater, whatever like whatever theme is in. Everybody want to do so. I'm most likely, well, I'm for sure going to a, a Christmas pajama party. So I got some of these. This one is actually my favorite. Like, I can't wait to wear this one instead. See this? It's like the same as this one, but it's got the red outline. How freaking cute is that, right? I didn't try these on, but both of them are in a medium and they were only $25. $25 at Target. It's probably going to be too late by the time y'all see this. Or probably not. But if y'all haven't, make sure y'all go pick these up. And they probably going to be on sale like after Christmas. And it ain't nothing wrong with wearing these pajamas like around the house still even after Christmas. Because I know I am. I love a good like Christmas. I mean, I love like a good pajama set. Like whether it's like the satin kind, the silk kind, or you know. Just like a matching pajama set, I feel like they just always essential. Whether you're going out of town or whether you just walking around your house, like you don't. I personally do not like to walk around my house mix match. Like that's just how I am. I'm very like, like on my shit when it comes to looking good. Like that's just how I am. Like I have to look put together, even when I'm in the house. So if I don't have on a robe, I have on like a matching set, like. I have on like a matching like satin set or something like that. Y'all don't see it because I'm usually like, I'm usually like always oh, recording in the daytime. Well, this is an outfit. That looks crazy. But that's what's going on today on this 
freaking beautiful Sunday in Houston. It's actually a bit chilly outside, y'all. The weather is picking up. Because mind you, it's been like a hot, hot December. This whole, like, this whole, what are we in? Winter now? Winter, fall, whatever. It doesn't even matter. Because at this point, we ain't been getting this, the weather that it's supposed to be giving. It's been getting hot. Very much hot. Like, it, I, I, ain't had to, I ain't had to put on a coat yet it's just been the same like temperature of warm nothing more than less warm so that's that's i don't know i don't really know what we get into the into today but we shall see we shall see oh i forgot to show y'all my other uh christmas pajamas it was these christmas pajamas that i got from air Postle. So that means I, I got a good bit of Christmas pajamas. Like those Christmas pajamas is like most likely for when I go back home, from when I go back home to Ben Ridge because that's, you know, where I celebrate like my holidays at. So I'm probably gonna wear them there because I know that I have like a, at first I was saving them for me and my, my little friend, but we we haven't gotten a chance to wear them because we both be like like busy doing our own thing. So we ain't really get a chance to do that. Plus he been like sick and I'm not going to get sick. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to get sick. So we didn't do it. But it's cool though because I still can like use those. And like I said, we're going to do something in Baton Rouge with my family. And we're going to do um, like a Christmas party with like my extended family. And when I say extended family, I mean like me family. Like just my friends, my, my friends, uh, friends. Friends, family. So, you know, that's that. But I also wanted to show you guys these really cute freaking jeans that I got. Somebody actually gifted them to me. Well, they was like hand-me-downs, but you know, I'm still going to rock them, to be honest. Keep it real. Keep it real. It's nothing. We're getting some things out your friend's closet. Like, if your friends don't want their outfits no more. Because I would give my friends. If I had, like, guy friends, I would give them, like, all of my clothes, to be honest. Because I really only, no shade, I really only wear my clothes, like, once or twice, to be honest. Especially if it's, like, a real significant outfit. Like, I probably only wore it once or twice, to be honest. But if it's, like, like. I make sure to keep like some of my good essential stuff, but anything that's, you know, y'all follow me on Instagram, but like y'all seen my pants and like the type of like clothes I wear, I don't know. I can't really explain it, but nonetheless, you know, I only wear my clothes like once or twice and I would love to like give them to my like actual people that I know versus sending the clothes off to like the Salvation Army. Like I'm not, I have a bag right now over here that needs to go to like, uh, the Salvation Army, like, for people that's in need. And I give away clothes all the time. But it's, like, like little knick-knack clothes, not, like, real clothes that I, you know, that I that I spit the good coin on that, you know, is very significant to me out of the archive. Like, I got some fly stuff, not gonna lie, but that's that. I got a load of clothes in the washing machine and in the dryer. And... I also have to fold some. So that's just like a task. If you know, you know, you got to fold clothes and you got to put them up. <sighs> then you got to put the next one in. It's just like a repetitive cycle. So we're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see. We're going to see. But what y'all been, been up to? What y'all been up to? Tell me what y'all getting into for the New Year's. You know, what's going on? Do y'all really celebrate, I mean, like, the holidays like that? Because I know a lot of people, they don't even celebrate the holidays like that. And you know, y'all want to know something? I don't know not one person that, like, celebrates, like, Kwanzaa or Hanukkah or nothing like that. And that's crazy. I don't know anybody who does that, but that would be, like, so... I'm so intrigued into if you know the, the people are doing it like cause i don't know anybody but if you are if you're somebody out there who celebrates kwanzaa or hanukkah like that's a beautiful interesting thing and i'm probably soon i'm probably gonna end up like going do some research about it because now that i said it out loud i'm even more curious to know like wow what is that like 
what is that like because i feel like i learned about it before in school but i forgot like now seriously to be honest don't shade me about it but i honestly forgot and i am low-key running out of hangers so i'm gonna put this in my set drawer i want to get like a whole bunch of sets like especially like black like sweat sweatpants and sweatshirt set like those are essential as seriously they're so essential because it's nothing like just throwing on like a regular black set it's nothing like throwing on a regular black set all these clothes on this side I'm trying to get rid of but i guess we'll catch back up when i do uh when i get done with my laundry i actually want to do a i set up all of this stuff on freeman see i never have time to use this stuff because every time i go to bed it's like always late because i'm always coming back from like the club or something but sundays i really want to start dedicating my sundays to like self-care like complete self-care like i say it and i do it every now every other like sunday or something like that but i want to make it like i want to make it like a routine like every sunday you know i you know i do like a full self-care day and now i'm talking about like shaving my body doing a face mask like conditioning my hair type vibe like i need to add that routine in my life so we're trying to get on track with that but we shall see we shall see we shall see but like i said i'll hit you guys back up once i get done like doing everything hopefully i come back put together and out of this outfit because you know who wants to look like this all day so we're currently on the way to this little space so you can take some samples. use the left two lanes to take a slight that left turn right there siri she will do a lot of yapping like siri mm -hmm. But we're on the way to take Nick some savage expensive pictures. Use know the left lane to take a slight left turn, turn, then turn left. The new pup, Uzi. This is Nick's dog. Nick and her boyfriend dog. Use the left two go. lanes to keep left, then continue straight. I hate that it does that light like that. Like, what the fuck? This is Houston. You never know where to turn. You make one wrong turn, and then. <clears throat> It take you fucking 60 minutes. Yeah. Back. You, you Continue six minutes, on to Allen Parkway. Six minutes right now. Wrong, one wrong turn, you do 16. Just that quick. But this is the new pup. Uzi. Uzi. Uzi, baby. Stormy, honey. You just Stormy. look like mommy. We got her face beat today. For no reason. No reason. No reason. Y'all know I be recording off my phone, so like the lighting just be so different. I thought it was good morning. It's like making me like go in and out, in and out of like brightness. But Nika had makeup done in her hair, curl, she curled her hair. Well, it's kind of filling now. Yeah, oh, you didn't bring a uh, curler? Yeah, I did. So we're going to take some quick pictures. Let me try to... At the light, use the left lane to yeah, make a turn. Two hours. I, I wanted to see, at first it was getting like the little Christmas, uh, like pit, like whatever it's called, to do her hair. Maybe that's what it was. Man, no. But she was going to get like the Christmas. Make a U-turn. But then her kid left and he went with his daddy. But I was going to try to sneak in. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Sneak me in. I want to do like a cute little like. Oh, that would have been cute. Little one-two for I Christmas. I forgot you wanted to do a one-two for Christmas too. Because I showed y'all those cute pajamas. Those cute pajamas was pretty, pretty oh, cute. Oh, not this man. I didn't went all the way up. Now what he happened? can't even. Oh. Like through. Oh. In a quarter mile, keep left onto Allen Parkway. But this is all Uzi wants to do, y'all. What's this part? Look at him. He just lays there. He doesn't. He doesn't do much. Sometimes he. Sometimes he play. What day is it now that we had him? Uh, day three. Day three, oh, and gotta be day three. He's still the stinking cutest little thing there is out there. And he's been pooping and shitting and shitting and then pooping and peeing and. Pissing and, pissing and peeing all over. No. That was all you had to fix. But I mean, when you take selfies, how many fucking selfies? Use the do second you lane from left to keep left up? onto Allen like, Parkway. I didn't feel like the smiling ones matched. If I was a girl, energy. I probably would touch my hair all day. Like, I probably would do this. 
Sure, what you would do with the pixie cut? Keep left. <laughs> keep right. <laughs> Girl. Use the right cut. lane to keep right. Just shake it. Just do like this. <laughs> Just shake it in front of my head. But I did not change clothes. Keep right. On this then seat. take a slight right <clears throat> turn. I'm so sick of this bitch, Siri. I'm going I'm to well, chat back with y'all. Use the I'm right lane to take a slight right turn this to merge onto I-45. What you say about me? I don't know, man. Fuck a song of biscuit. If I get his swinging on a big bitch. Oh, look at that. 444. See that? 444. Check that out. Period, poo. Period, poo. Look at him laying down. Miss Mama's in the back. We're going to try this drywall oh. and see what yeah. I can do with it. Playing advertisement. Sit him on that couch. And yeah, sit you down, little Uzi Beer. I'm going to check out a uh, place. All right, so let me give you a quick little tour of this. What I don't even know what it's called. It's like slight Airbnb, slight, you know, little photography place. We got Uzi over here. This is literally all he wants to do. Say what's up. I don't want to wake you up. You can do what you were doing. But that's all he wants to do. I don't know why I'm breathing like I just ate like 10 honey buns or something. But this is this place. It's Face. I don't even know like what's the aesthetics of this. It's giving like boho hipster type vibes. Yeah, and I'm not a girl that gets this. We got Miss Mama's coming out the back. Let me see you walk, 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 walk. You did swipe ups? No, girl. I do that at home. <laughs> We're gonna head out. And let me tell you this. When it comes to a haircut appointment, I bet you I never miss it again. And that's on soul. I can act up for baby. He should have told you about me. But we finna head out. $217. Yeah, man. A little A, bird. Uzi? Hey. You ready to roll? First day at work with mommy, baby. First day at work. He just be chilling. Let's go. He really my dog. Like, to be honest. Oh, no. All right, I'm, I gotta get some things. I don't know, it's just something about this elevator that gives me the creeps. Like, why am I in the tin can? Mm -hmm. Why am I in the tin can? Like, you get stuck in this? Me, personally, I told you, I would just, just bang my head against the wall, because I don't think I could do it. <laughs> I just won't be able to do it personally, but you know. Um, yeah. Ah, you got stuck in the elevator before? Uh-oh, uh -oh. I got stuck in an elevator before. It was from my 16th birthday party that time. And ooh, I'm always just doing some crazy stuff. I almost said something crazy too just now. But you know, yeah. Oh, look, this little place, they got the lobby decorated. It's like a real artsy type of place. With no presents. With no motherfucking presents. All right, so y'all, they have this freaking like the bodega. I should have put on clothes. Obviously. Well, you ran out of outfits. <laughs> but y'all, they have like this, you know, the bodega that they have in like NYC or whatever that's on the corner, but it's black on. And I just keep seeing it. Well, I seen it when I was going in. And I just thought it was so cool. So now I gotta go see what's in here. I'm saying, can I get a chopped cheese before I smack the shit out of you? Well, yeah, they don't have chopped cheeses here. Oh, girl, where you been up here? Girl, hold on, I gotta show y'all. This is too stinking cool. Girl, girl what is that? They got the ice cream? Hold on, man. I gotta, I gotta. <laughs> No 
place for me to return to. This was the only place I could go. I put on my jewelry just to go to the double digger. They got four locals here? I'll drink one of those. Yeah, he said no, they all said four locals. Oh. You see a bag of chips, Neek? Yeah, they all right there. I got hot fries. I got hot fries. Where you see them? Where? Right here. They're down there. I want like, uh. Oh, right here. Hmm. Okay, okay, I can't. I'm so excited. So, I don't know how. I don't know how, but we ain't talking. Chicken wings. Girl, what is this? Girl, that's that good stuff. Meat, peas, carrot. Chicken fried rice, beef, chicken. Look, I hate this. I'm putting them on the camera right now. Let me do this. But we in Target. Why? I don't know. Oh, I do know. We came here to get the, the young pup. A cage because you know, we young and lit. I'm gonna buy this because it's $20. Girl, not you penny pitching. <laughs> I'm gonna get a few of them to see if you like it. In that case, bitch, if I'm pretty sure it does for it's gonna chicken. equal up to like $15, which means well, you might as well get a pack. Piece, but true, girl, she's on the budget. But look at this cute little kitchen set that Nick is getting Kaiser. She barely let it. No, I'm not gonna lie. She do let him go up some time in the kitchen, so I can see why she would get there. You know. He like playing in the kitchen. <sighs> you know, my son. He, my son. He could definitely. He in my little kitchen set. Ain't nothing wrong with the kitchen set. Period, fool. They playing the tunes in here. By the way, we got Uzi. Uh, laying in the thing. Ooh, is that sparkling or is that just? What you call it? Oh. Oh, oh, Nick, why would you burn me down this owl? All these people. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Yeah, girl, you do need some of that. No lie. Do kids still like Baby Shark? I don't know, because you know that was like the anthem at one time. Baby <clears throat> I don't have a kid, but I can only imagine what it's like for these parents that got kids, <clears throat> multiple kids. Like the people who have like multiple kids, they gotta buy stuff for their little girls, their little boys. It's probably two little girls, two little boys. Like, man, I bet you the Christmas time is like beautiful, but I bet you it's definitely very overwhelming. Excuse me. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. Just eat. Excuse me. Okay. Oh. Girl, Nika left me all of this stuff. Looking on a what aisle? What aisle is this? Who are you looking for, Nika? I don't know. I'm about over target at this point, though, because I'm tired of walking around. We got two baskets because Nika wants to. I don't. I don't even know what that stuff is in there, to be honest. To be honest, but let's see. Let me got the way. Girl, I haven't seen this sign in so long. Blockbuster. What the hell is that? It's an ice cream. It's an ice cream truck. If I had a little girl, I'd get a little a frontal wig. <laughs> a frontal wig for Christmas. Mm -hmm. Hey, babe, it's your very first frontal. I'm gonna teach you how to lay it, slay it. Girl, what is that? It's Play-Doh. Yeah, Anik just been picking up stuff this whole time. I'm like, I just have to keep asking her what is that because I don't even think she's looking. <clears throat> I ain't gonna lie, I miss like, uh, I miss all this to be honest. Y'all know they still making Dire but Wimpy Kid uh, books. 
And I know y'all used to read Diary with the Kid books because everybody used to read Diary with the Kid books because it was the shit, to be honest. Cakes? They talking to you in a bakery? Yes, girl. I want a bakery. Girl, I should own a bakery where niggas bring the cake to me. It's cute too. Nah, this, 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 like, for real, low key, false advertising. Cause who and what kid is making this? This. Look at that. Exactly. Nobody kid is doing it. They just making shit up at this point. Back again. Back. Back, back. I just been so y'all. I look like I'm going to my son's football game. Like I, I'm giving straight up coach today with what I got on. But we're about to head to the mall to do some last minute Christmas shopping. No, it looks like in that Target bag right there. Oh, I forgot all about that seven car. But what we did yesterday. Oh, we ended up going to the bar with Jania, Early, and Jerk. And I didn't really record because we were there for like, not even 10 minutes, probably. Probably 10 minutes. But afterwards, we left. We hit out some other spots unexpectedly. And you know, just kind of vibe. It wasn't giving all of that crazy stuff. But I guess it did get, I guess it did get a bit crazy. Because we didn't come home for that. Why? I don't know. I don't know. And period, that's what we got on a uh, tracksuit from Fashion Nova. Fashion who? Fashion who? No. We got a Chanel back on. And ready to rumble. Come here, Uzi. Let's show people. Uzi actually had on his um. His hoodie, his first little outfit. Here he is. Here. 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 Oh, girl, I gotta put me a haircut appointment because y'all still don't have a haircut. And last night, I just was eating sad and sad every time I thought about it. Go. Oh, bitch, let's leave. I'm ready. I'm ready, too. Let's rock it on. You know what? I'm ready. It's time to rock and roll. What'd you say about me? Let's go. Let's go get everything, go to the target, get wrapped, everything. Girl, look at me with this hat, y'all. I don't even wear I haven't been wearing no hats like this in a while. We going to Target again? Uh, either Walmart, bitch, somewhere else. They don't got. They got toy stores out here, huh? Yeah, they got a. Oh, I was gonna say they have a toy store in the in the mall. I know they got some shit. Bitches love to uh, eat other people's fries. It's me. I'm bitches. But I listen. Just said, Give me some fries. Mm. I'm putting y'all on. So this I never soup, had that soup at tor uh, tortilla. It's a tortilla Turn soup right at Chick Fil A. I'm telling you, bomb. See, I know it gives sketchy, but Take it's a good. Take a slight right turn onto Taylor Street. I can, I can imagine that it's good. And this time, I'm adding extra um, chicken in here. But see, it's it got like beans and stuff in there. I don't know why it's just giving me protein. Like, oh, bitch, it's gonna help me gain weight. So I just keep eating these because it's got like a lot of beans and shit in there. I mean, plus it's just good too. Mm. Mm. Then it come with like this little bag of like little tortilla chips. I'm telling you, I'm telling you. Oh, that's what you got last time. I was wondering why you was putting fucking tortilla in your mm -hmm. soup. So that's that. Now we're headed. We just finished looking at a venue for unique birthday festivities, and I don't know what we're doing. We just sitting here just. Just, just thinking about life. Life is crazy, yeah, though. There's like something every day. Everybody always got something going on. And I know if we feel like this, I can only imagine the other people out there whose brains are just racing with life. But, oh, bitch, you just do some crazy stuff. Yeah, just turn. But, how do you feel? Is my burger in there? I'm hungry. Go like my camera. So fancy. All right, let me see y'all at the mall.
I kid you not, we in Target again for what? With the, 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 the fucking Bitch, third time. This. And me and Nick, we're about to go ahead and play dolls. Play fucking dolls. What's that one? She get her feet done. Girl, not the pedicure. Any petties in her vanity? Hold on, they got a freaking, uh, it's an ice cream truck, yeah, which a whole ice cream. Y'all, yeah, they have everything for these dolls. I don't even know. I thought this was like the American girl dolls. Like, I know, like, my cousin used to play with those, but they not that. And it, let me show y'all. Oh, oh, I'm ripping her. I'm ripping her. Sorry. Neek love the kids. Love the kids. Let me see what else I have. Yeah, I really want this one. Look. Look at this, y'all. See, why well, I couldn't play with this when I was little? They try to tell little boys, oh, don't play with dogs. Let them sure and play what they want to play with. Then they got him. Gabe. I don't, I don't, I like she the. She's just not girly enough for me. I like Miss Mama's right here with the dog. Look at this one. She got a dog. She got green eyes. But I guess. She's cute though. She got ballerina. She got her little tutu on. She's pink. And she got a freaking ticket to her, to her thing. I have a whole storyline going on. Girl, they, she blinking. Girl, she blinking. See, that's why I draw the line. I don't put like that. Oh. <laughs> Under pressure. All right, y'all. So it's the end of this vlog. I appreciate y'all so much for tuning in. Thank y'all so much. Because if you made it to the end of this video, you just the GOAT, period. Like, we GOATs. We the GOATs. Okay, the greatest of all time. I appreciate y'all so much. Thank y'all for like tuning in, vlog at the vlog at the vlog, video at the video at the video, whatever it is, whatever content I'm putting out, y'all right there, y'all supporting me. So happy holidays to everybody. Um, I'll definitely see y'all in the next video. I'm getting ready to like pack up and like get ready to go back to Baton Rouge for the holidays, Christmas and New Year's. And we just walking into the New Year's on some uh, boss move type vibe so and update i still have no haircut still have no haircut so i'm about to hurry up and get off here because i can't bear to even look at how far i look into more make sure you guys like comment and subscribe right now if you was new here and if you enjoyed this video make sure you go ahead and give it this one a thumbs up and go watch my last videos and i'll see you on the next vlog